Hello people, my name is Dennis and today I'm going to show you how to build employment application database. using Microsoft Access so in this database we're gonna have 11 sections so section 1 is general contact info So, let's draw how it's going to, it should look like, and we'll go ahead and build section one. So, it's going to look like this. General info, maybe date of birth. And H then social security number and then we will have table Divide this into five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And try and align this. Oops, we're gonna try and fix fit the wells in there. So now we will go last name. First name, middle initial. Think I need to go back and do this again. Let me choose a different color and let's make this like this, like this, then like this. What happened? Okay, now address city 
um, phone. Email. Then first name. Apartment number. And state cell phone and that is it for section one and also we're gonna put maybe receive date This is how the form should look like, and also there is um, a third column here. Let me put it right here. Middle initial, then zip code. And finally, to the state. So this is how the form should look like. I will take the date off from now. And also, I'm going to put something here. Application status. Not yet, also, not yet. I'll put it after review. So let's go to Microsoft Access and get this going, and we will see how it will look like. And let's name this employment application. The base section one. Here we go to design view go to location deployment up section one table let's name this section one ID Yes, uh, and receive date.
gonna be doing multiple sections so we will how I have made the section a tracking number you can name it whatever you want and I'll go date of birth age social security number and we go I'll do first name we're gonna change this a little bit name middle initial last name preferred name address city address apartment number city state zip code and I'll make this short telephone and finally email email address let's go ahead and format this table date this is a date this is a number and this is also a number this one this one is a number apartment number telephone telephone is on input max yes and I am already prompted to the telephone that's the first one so I'm gonna click finish and the email is a hyperlink on the zip code let's go to input max and look for a zip code yes zip code and I'll take this last ones and I'll click finish um, telephone yeah it's already from already else can I format social security I think I can format yes there is social security finish and save close and open we are now done with section one and let's create the form first form design
form design. And we're gonna bring some labels and stuff together. I'm gonna name this general info contact info. And I'm gonna bring this and Make this stuck and bring some tables below, some to the right. I will move this back and some above, and I'll bring this and delete. I'll delete this one, bring this right here, and make this section one. Now, I will bring we 